We have new details tonight and a CBS 46 crime alert. Athens Clark County Police have arrested a woman for the deadly shooting of a pregnant mother. The victim, 24 year old Arielle Calloway, was holding her young son when she was shot and killed. Police say she was an innocent bystander caught in the crossfire of a fight. CBS 46's Ayana Hughes. She joins us now with the very latest. Ayani, the story is just terrible. Yeah, Sean, it definitely is an unfortunate event that has taken place, but there has been a break in the case, which is good. The Athens Clark County Police have arrested a key suspect in the murder of 24 year old Ariel Calloway. Now, the tragedy, um, although this was a tragedy for her friends and family, they wanted to make sure that they came together and remembered her in the most positive light. Now, if you take a look at your screen, you're looking at this woman. It's 27 year old Kyrisa Cooper. She was the one who who was arrested Thursday today for the shooting of 24 year old Ariel Calloway. After just two days of arresting or investigating, Cooper was located by police in Cobb County. She was taken into custody, then transported to the Athens Clark County Jail. The shooting all happened on Tuesday night. Calloway was with her son at her home in Clark Garden Apartments when a fight broke out. Gunfire started and Calloway was hit by a stray bullet as she was trying to move her three year old son out of the way. Her child was unharmed, but she was taken to a local hospital where she later died. Unfortunately, her unborn child didn't make it either. Callaway's family and friends are in disbelief at the tragedy. They're stunned, in fact, but are coming together to honor her life and remember her not only as a victim, but as a mother of, of a mother who touched many and left behind a legacy. It hurts to see this environment turn into what it is. So we just like, you know, we can just come together as a, just not as a world, just as a unit. We gotta start somewhere. So we wanna start at home first. If we could start at home, just try to stop the violence at home, then maybe it'll trickle out throughout the country, throughout the nation. And guys, the Athens Clark County Police tell me they do believe that there was more than one shooter and they are still investigating the case to find others involved in the shooting. Now, our CBS 46 reporter Trace Bragg will have the latest updates coming up at 6 o'clock and he'll also be speaking with friends and family to keep you updated on that as well. For now, we're live in Athens. Ayani Hughes, CBS 46 News. Ayani, thank you. Friends and family are gathering to remember Ariel Calloway at a vigil tonight. It will be at the Clark Garden Apartments that's in Athens. It starts less than two hours away at 7 tonight.